Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Maths DNA from origin to infinity. Before we begin, let me ask you a question. Can you solve this number puzzle where 2 plus 10 is equal to 24, 3 plus 6 is equal to 27, 7 plus 2 is equal to 63, then 5 plus 3 is equal to how much? Comment your answer below in the comment box with proper explanation. Today, we are going to solve a question of CSI Net Mathematics December 2019 Part B Linear Algebra. The question is, let C01 be the space of continuous real valued functions on 01. Define fg is equal to integral 0 to 1 ft gt square dt for all fg belongs to C01. Then which of the following statement is true? A. It is an inner product on C01. B. It is a bilinear form on C01 but is not an inner product on C01. C. It is not a bilinear form on C01. And D. F, F is greater than or equal to 0 for all F belongs to C01. Before solving the question, let us revise the definitions. Let u, v, w be vectors and alpha and lambda be scalars. We define inner product which satisfies the given below four conditions and bilinear form which satisfies the given below two conditions. Now let us solve the question. Solution For option A, it is an inner product on C01 and option D, f, f is greater than or equal to 0 for all f belongs to C01. Consider ft is equal to minus 1 then we have f, f is equal to integral 0 to 1 ft into ft square dt which is equal to 0 to 1 ft cube dt which is equal to 0 to 1 minus 1 cube dt. Taking minus 1 outside we get 0 to 1 1 dt which is equal to minus 1 t from 0 to 1 which is equal to minus 1 which is less than 0. It does not satisfy the fourth condition of the inner product. Also it does not satisfy the option D. Therefore f, f is not an inner product on C01. Therefore A and D are false. Now option B. It is a bilinear form on C01 but is not an inner product on C01. And option C. It is not a bilinear form on C01. For f, alpha g is equal to 0, 1 ft alpha gt square dt, we get alpha square taking it outside 0 to 1 ft gt square dt which is equal to f alpha g is equal to alpha square fg. Therefore, it is not a bilinear form on C01 because for bilinear we need alpha fg not alpha square fg. Therefore, b is false and C is true which says that it is not a bilinear form on C01. Hence the correct answer is option C. Thank you. Check out other videos in the series over here.